All right, enough Chelsea. How about some quick hits instead? Let's go, Gav. A late Casemiro goal gives Manchester United a 1-0 win away to Nottingham Forest and sends them into the quarterfinals yes. of the FA Cup. Jules, he's had his critics. He's, he's had his injuries. He's had. But as Ten Hag points out, they've lost just one game in 2024. That's very true. They beat Wigan and Newport. Uh, Stop. I'm kidding. And, so Luton, and Luton. I'm so mean. I'm so mean. Let's not. Yeah, one draw against Spurs <laughs> and, uh, and then the defeat against Fulham. And that's it. So it's a good, I know it's a good start of the year. I'm sorry, that game is so underwhelming. They had chances and McTominay could have scored earlier on that. Late, How many late times have we got, said McTominay could have scored know, this season? Is, if, again, going back to Gallagher, if you rely on McTominay scoring <laughs> goals for you, for you to win, there's something wrong in here. I know they've got injuries again with Hoyland mostly missing, which means Rashford plays up front and he's really not good in that position. This is not his position. Can I, can I say my I told you so? Yeah, you told you me so. You can't go into the season with Martial and Hoyland as That's very true. That is very true. You were right. Yeah. You know, you, we all know you wanted Bas Dost at the club. <laughs> Unfortunately, that could not happen. Anthony, I mean, what's the point? There's no point there. But, but they won't. They find a way yeah. again to winning, which is the most important. But... Um, but is City away at the weekend and that could be a very different Is story. Amrabat your left back now the rest of the season? I mean, I don't know if you remember against Galatasaray in the Champions League he was playing left back. He made that terrible back pass that cost them I, maybe the penalty and the red card or something like that. He made another one yesterday that was so bad. Aboni could not do anything with it. But I, and I know, there's, I know there's injuries and stuff. But I don't know, Amrabat, the guy never plays in his own position. And when he plays, it's in a different position. Oh, I mean, I don't know. This this is just a shamble. Speaking of the game, that game they lost, Gabby. The guard, the guard, the Guardian says, the Guardian another report that some senior players asked for the day off after that home defeat, the home defeat against Luton on Saturday, but were denied. What do you make of all of this? I think this is a bit mischievous. I think this is again, this is people's PRs, people's agents saying, oh look, they did this. I hope it's not the club leaking it. I have no problem with Ten Hag uh, turning it down because obviously the game, day after games anyway, it's just a warm down, maybe some video study. Um, Ten Hag's entitled to make his right decisions. I don't see why this is a story. And the reason I bring it up is because it's the kind of thing where they lost this game and they said, oh, these lazy players, they wanted the day off. No, you well, have usually to. you don't ask for a day off after, after a loss. Maybe sometimes you want to clear your mind. Well, I don't, I don't have know. an issue with it. 